every time it's a tape, it's a group, or we use it interchangeably. But really, you are talking of working in a group, no? it's an aggravation. But actually, this is really a definition of what a team is. No? So you're talking of what a group of two or more thing, no? parang two or more gathered in my name. No? Nakalika, it's the same. So you're talking about interacting and influencing. My question is, when you did the activity, did you interact? Did you interact? Yes. You had a lot of interaction. Okay. Were you able to influence each other? Yes. In terms of the song, how to deliver. Because that's the final output no? that uh, you are to, at least in that activity. Are you mutually accountable? Yes. Kung pangit man, o maganda yung ganda. Yes. 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 Accountable. Okay? And then, you're a social entity. Kaya sabi ko yung concept po kuli ng people management, social system. So, you're a group. You're a social entity. No? Within an organization. That's why, when you put it in the context of catechetical ministry, my question is, is your ministry a team? Given this definition can think of, are you really a team? Do you interact? Do you influence each other? Common objectives? Something that you, now I'm talking of practical, no? about your your catechetical ministry. Are you able to answer this component? Interaction. Mutual accountability. Ito pa upang may mutual accountability down the line? O mutual accountability na sa taas lang? Diba? So kasi ang key, when you talk of mutual, activity, uh, mutual accountability, you're talking of hanggang mula sa ilalim, no? from the volunteers up, hindi pwedeng up lang. That's the concept of the team. Kaya dito, ang hierarchy hindi pa baba. Eh, actually, in a team, bilog eh. You have seen some structures, no? It's no longer hierarchical na you top uh, down, but you're really talking of a circle. In that case, no more of circular, wherein everybody is accountable. Yung isa. And then I don't know if you have taken this in some other seminars, but consciously, if you are managing a team, you need to be conscious that a team has a life. No, it's like a person you develop. I don't know if you were conscious about it. Kanina in the simulation, in the activity, did you go through this stage? Stop forming, papa. Because I counted, no. So you didn't know who will be your uh, teammates. So when you talk of, did you still get to know each other in your activity, Kanina? Getting to know in the sense that you're trying to sense each other. Where are you initially? No, ano bang si okay ba si sister? Matibiru ba si father? Pwede ba rito isiwalat yung mga? Di ba yung initial? That is the getting to know stage. No? Um, in many teams, depending on... Uh, how big you are, who are the people, yung background, yung getting to know stage. Maro rin sa parokya, pag bago kang parokya, bago kang parish priest, yung, tra yung getting to know mo depende sa composition ng mga tao sa parokya, di ba? Merong mga taong very welcoming, may mga taong very what? Yung, um, sino naman to, no? Yung parang ganun, hindi welcoming sa mga tao, depende rin sa pagkakakilala sa iyo. So, ganun din ang team. So, when you work on a team, yung how fast you're able to go to, uh, to know each other, it's really dependent on how big you are, the background, and the interest of each one. No? And the kind of what purpose that you really bring with you when you are in that group. And then, after that, you have the storming. Ito, very common naman. No? Sabi niyo, ano yung controlling for status. Kasi lahat ng team will always go to this. Ano? Yung misan eh, hindi, misan they were not conscious about it. No? Sabi mo, simbahan, wala, meron yan. Yung mga konti niya, bang, gusto mo pakita, magaling ka kaysa sa kanya. No? Without saying that you read. But really, the way you speak, the way you say it to other people, misan unconscious, no? pero lumalabas na ganun eh. I think uh, there are people where in, gusto mo you are in power, ikaw yung nag-ehead, ikaw. Kaya kanina when they ask, assign a leader, di ba? Rather than yung stage na magpapapagtitingnan yung pa kung sino yung mas magaling, di ba? Kasi tayo, Pilipino, gusto natin yung leader, yung lahat magaling, no? Parang ganun. Magaling, pati yung budsa, dapat may laman. Di ba? That is the difficulty of 
as Filipino, that's why even in the parishes, yung nagiging leader, tingnan nyo, yung may, mas may kaya compared to the others, di ba? Meron ka ba nakita ang leader talaga poorest of the poor in your community? Wala kasi merong kailangan na pera, tapos merong kailangan na kaunting na pag-aralan. Di ba? Yun ang reality. You cannot really get someone, no matter how committed, na hindi talaga nakapag-aral, at wala nang kahit paano, walang, kasi kung wala kang pamasahe, papunta dun sa meeting place, di ba? Hindi ka naman makaka, kaya hindi ka nagiging leader in that sense, not the lead person. So that is very important in the storming stage, no? You, how fast you are in terms of getting what? Getting for me, getting rid of that yabang. Eh. Yung bang, yung bang, maging humble ka. Kasi minsan, di ba sa mga meeting, ang tagal yung portion na to, kasi yung yabang natin, hindi natin ibinababa eh. Di ba? Yung to be humble in a meeting, oh, you can be the... You can be a very good parish priest season. Na nasanay tayo ng ano si Bang problema na para kay Bang talaga otoritarian na ano? We always defer dun sa highest position yung yung nandon. Nasabing pa na mga parik ba? Wala po ako ng shape. Tapos si Bang wala po ako ng parik. Kano na uli tang sakop no? Kasi kailangan yung mas matagal na yung mga yun ang masusunod. Ah, ganun ba? Yung bang, di, hindi ganun mga makakasagot kung ganun ang kultura that you follow that seniority issue. Di ba? I think that's part also. And I have seen that in a lot of, uh, lot of praise sa simbahan. Sino yung bagong orte? Ikaw ngayon ang kakanta sa Lenten. So, sa Sandel, kung sasin kung kahit wala sa tono, <laughs> ang dami mong gagay, parang bago eh. Kasi kung sino yung bago sa mga yun. Kasi ganun lagi. I, I'm not saying, I don't know, in, sa ako yung experience ko, lagi ko nakikita ang gano'n. Kung sino yung bago, siya yung gumagawa ng mahirap. <laughs> Tama ba yun? Ano? 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 But, eh kung ganun na wala naman kami magagawa as lay, no? We just follow, we defer to the whatever the existing. Kasi we follow the authority. Yun naman yung ano niya, di ba? So yun yung sa team. Kasi sa team, ang difference nito, yung authority, hindi pwede mo masyado i-invoke. Ang concept kasi <coughs> ng team is, normally yung power ay hindi vested on one person. Kaya ito napakahirap sa simbahan. Okay? Ang concept ng team is not so much of authority of one, but it's really the power and it rests among the members of the team. Kaya napakatagal nito pagka ito sa community natin. Pinakikita ko lang na pwedeng mangyari, pero talagang yung bilis mo kung ikaw yung ah, papano yung ibababa yun, talagang it's a challenge. No? Di ba kahit ano ba, katikista, kasama niyo yung mga day, di ba kayo na po ma'am, di ba kayo sa, kayo na po bahala. Basta may senior, lagi hindi defer to the senior. Am I right? Yung parang lahat ng ano yung senior. Yung junior, parang wala ka, wala ka ka muna doon, di ba? Wala ka muna ang say. But in a team, hindi kasi ganun ang konsepto. Regardless of age, regardless of length of service, ang concept kasi everyone can contribute something. Uh, significant or meaningful to the team. Parang kanina, when you were working in your uh, team, nung sa kanta na, meron ba dyan senior na kinonsider nyo pa ba yung senior? Wala. Hindi. Di ba kinonsider? Sino makapagal? Hindi ba lang? Sino yung inaisip? Di ba? Doon hindi nyo naisip ka, naisip nyo ba kanina siya yung ede siya yung ano? Wala. Di ba? Ano ang kinonsider nyo na tadel? Di ba? Sino yung may tono, sino'y makakakontribute. That is the concept of the team. So, nawawala yung authority. Hinahanap mo, sino yung meron siya sa kanya? Oo, yung kakayanan. Who has the competency to be able to achieve the task or to do the task? Yun ang ano, nawawala yun eh. Kasi kahit ko'y senior, wala ka namang i-contribute, itahimik ka muna. Diba? So, sino yung meron kakayanan? Sino yung hindi mahiya eh, no? Sino yung makapal? And then the dorming, so certain rules, you follow, yung pagano naman sa meeting. Kasi importante din yun, kasi hindi siya nakakagulo eh, di ba? It's important for people also to follow certain rules sa meeting. Sino magsasalita, kailan matatapos, yung gano'n, no? I don't know if you follow that in your team. Kanina, o sabay-sabay ba, o isa-isa, kanina may na-observe ako, 
小木呢，尺寸不佳，有一扇 window 木呢，打打不起来 window， 该打一扇都打不起来小 window， 能打得很漂亮。Kaya lang yun ang kanilang napag-usapan as a norm na susundin ng everyone. And then, that's the time that you perform, you indicate the strategy dun sa trabaho, and then you come up with a song, di ba? And then practice. And then, it is fun the team after the presentation. Yun yung simulation. I just want to show you the process that you went through. Some teams mas matagal, some teams mas mabilis, kasi as I've said, the The time that you spend per stage is dependent on the number of people, the composition of the people, and the behavior, and interest that you invest in the team. Ganun talaga yun. So, theoretically, that's how it goes. Ngayon, pwede niyan, when you go back to your respective parishes, tingnan nyo, oo nga, ano? Ano nga ba nangyayari sa amin? Kasi minsan, bakit kami ang tagal-tagal? Minsan, di ba, tinatagal niyo yun? Hindi kasi pwede pare-pareho. Yun lang ang difference yan. Because you're dealing with people. Yun ang difference. Okay. Now, ngayon, may tanong na ako. There are three sets ng uh, PowerPoint slides that contain effective team. Yan, sagutin nyo as a team. These are the first set of characteristics of an effective team. O, yan. Tingnan nyo, mag-usap kayo. Meron ba kayo niya? Start with a clear purpose. O, mag-usap kayo. Meron ba kayo niya? How do you score your team? Yan sa simulation. Simulation sa lina. Uh, score of 4, yung 4, kasi sa lasal ang grade, ang highest na marilisip yung 4. The higher the number, the higher your grade. Yung 1 dito, uh, 70. Uh, yung 1 is 70 to 74, that's your grade. Yung 4, 97 to 100. So if you will score your team, ah, dyan, sa iba-iba, mag-score nga kayo as a team, mag-usap kayo. Score your team, so based on the performance. Score your team. So when you see 
Hindi it from the simulation mataas ang score kasi it's yes, simulation. But in reality now, the score will not be high. Yes, yes, diba? Kasi yun yung totoo. Eh, oh, diba? okay. Pagka dito, where do you think your ministry will need improvement most? Yan sa two forces. Uh, what do you think based on your experience? Where will you need more improvement on? Meaning, law score. And then dito, dito? Yeah. So, there is a lot of change, virtually everyone participates. Because in reality, dito, ang si Bishop, si Father, si Sister, may or may the coordinator of the ministry who may hire the rest, yet nakikita na very, very minimal ang contribution. Okay. How about the next step? With your ministry score high, similar to your score, to your like, again, it's low. No. So where do you think, in this case, will you need the more improvement on? Sa lahat? More of this? Yes. Number two. 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 Number I'm not saying na dapat na yun na, but slowly, it might make sense, you might be able to convince others to behave no, uh, that way. Kasi hindi madali ito, you are really talking of, uh, yung as I've said, power, you're talking of authority. Hindi na madaling i-diverse yan, no? In, in this sense. So, it's difficult. At saka yung people, readiness, 